Hi, I'm Tim Frost, and I'm going to look at how Vegas can make a slideshow like this from your stills. Forget all the fancy features that Vegas gives you. If you just want to show your photos quick and easily, Vegas has a great tool to turn them into a video in just a few minutes. First, put all the pictures you want into a single folder, just to make life easy for yourself. Here's a bunch of pics from years ago when I hosted an event with the lovely Anthony Daniels with our kids. Check that the project properties match what you're going to play it out on. Here I'm staying in high def. Now find the slideshow in Insert. Add the pictures. If you've got too many to sort manually, you can set the order alphabetically or in date order or simply randomly. And you can rearrange manually by drag and dropping or using the shift tool to rearrange them in the window. If one of the pictures is sideways, then use this to rotate it. If you're making this as a video, it's probably because you also want to add music. Put the cursor to the start by hitting the home button and then drop your music onto the audio timeline and take a note of its length. In settings, type that number into the total length, but remove a couple of seconds just to take into account the last transition. Set the transition time to one or two seconds and then when you create the slideshow, Vegas will automatically spread the images evenly over the timeline. If you're not matching to a fixed length, go to the settings and set how long you want each image to show and how long the transitions will be. Now the transitions. If you've got a lot of pictures, then use the random selection, which will use a different transition for each and every new picture. Pan and zoom automatically adds a bit of movement, which can add some extra interest, but it can be a bit unpredictable. So I suggest you get used to the way that it all works before you start using those. Now put the cursor to the start by hitting home again and hit create. And then in theory, you've done it all. In reality, there are a couple of further things to do. If you have any portrait vertical images, then they will show up with black lines on each side. You can leave them like that, or you can zoom in on them. Click on the image and the event pan crop and shrink the box to zoom in to the area you want. Finally, it's good to start with an effect and end with the fade. Just click on the top corners and drag them in and that will add an effect at the front and a fade at the end. So that's it, a quick and easy slideshow. This just goes to show that Vegas is not just for the sophisticated video edits.